I'm Mark Smith at the White House. In tonight's State of the Union speech, President Barack Obama is reaching out to newly empowered Republicans and agreeing with them that Uncle Sam needs to tighten his belt. Just not as much as the GOP wants to see right now. Ahead of the speech, the White House announced Obama's proposing a five-year freeze on non-defense, non-entitlement spending. But that will not affect new investments in education, research, and infrastructure, which Obama says America needs more of to create jobs. He calls that winning the future. Republicans maintain spending's out of control, and a freeze isn't good enough. They're demanding immediate cuts to bring spending back to 2008 levels. Despite these differences, lawmakers of both parties are sitting together tonight as a show of bipartisanship. I mean, a Congress still shaken by the assassination attempt against Arizona Congresswoman Gabrielle Giffords. The White House is hoping tonight's speech gives fresh legs to the modest uptick in the polls the president has recently seen. At the least, it will set the tone for two years of divided government and Obama's coming campaign for a second term. Mark Smith, The Associated Press. The White House.